our clients have been in illegal detention of the state for the last six days. I feel pain in my stomach and my chest. I have bruises all over. I can undress with your permission if you agree to be put on record. I can undress. It is with that that I ask to be given by you. If this honorable court is so pleased, and for the better health of our client, we shall pray that a ruling be delivered today. However, short adjournment, especially considering that the right to life of our client is also very vital. I am not here because of the authorship of two books, which I purely do not regret. You will have the time to thank yourself. An unfortunate day because we have appeared before a judicial officer and all our prayers have not been granted today, though pushed to Monday. 
However, we need to be patient and we need to pray for our colleagues until Monday so that they appear stronger than ever before. It has been very vivid, even in court, that our two clients were tortured, their rights were infringed upon, and we have made a very clear prayer in court that because of the infringement of their rights, this matter cannot proceed, or this honorable court consider it, considers it an annality. The second prayer we made is that at least they should get better medical treatment from SCTV, who are experiencing all over Africa for treating uh, all the victims of torture. Another third prayer we made was court to grant our order as soon as possible. And we are a bit pleased that at least within approximately three, four days we shall be appearing before this honorable court for a ruling in our matter. Now, it is a continuous infringement of our rights if state is not ready. But be it as it may, it has also been vivid not only to one of them, but also to the lady who cried to court and even requested to undress. Unfortunately, she didn't get a chance, but those are all the cries of not only one person or a victim, but also a cry of every Ugandan outside them. We didn't proceed with the bail because we knew that the, 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 the order granted for bail will be a temporary one. That's the reason why we went with human rights and our prayer was specifically one, analogy of this entire matter so that we don't come back to court.